Welcome back. Lifestyle medicine at Spectrum of Health will soon offer individual and group consultations and programming at the Grand Rapids Downtown Market location. They're partnering basically to help you transform your health using proven lifestyle change strategies. To tell us more, Christy Arts, the medical director of lifestyle medicine, and Chef Elizabeth Civetti, the manager of culinary medicine. Good morning, ladies. How are you? Good morning. Good morning. Well, thanks for joining us. You know, you are what you eat, right? Christy, introduce us to Spectrum Health's lifestyle medicine practice at the downtown market. When does this open? Hi, happy to do so. Our practice opens in January, so just right around the corner. Great time as you enter into the new year, as you're thinking about how to improve your health in 2021. Our lifestyle medicine practice will be launching. We'll be offering programs that look and help you to transform your health. Um, the ways that we eat, the ways that we move, the ways that we manage our stress, how we connect with our community and our families. These are all habits that we are involved with every single day and they actually can help um, both prevent better manage, and oftentimes even reverse chronic disease. So chronic disease truly is a lifestyle-related condition. So things like diabetes, cardiovascular disease, stroke, anyone who's looking to better manage those conditions or even prevent those conditions would be uh, a great patient in our new lifestyle medicine practice. Sounds wonderful. So what does a visit look like when I go to the downtown market and, and what sort of services are being offered? We're excited about the location of our practice with it being in the teaching kitchen space at the downtown market on the second floor. Um, in our medical group space, we have uh, myself and another physician who are specialty trained in lifestyle medicine. And we have a team that works alongside of the physicians to wrap around um, the care that is oftentimes required to help patients improve their health behaviors. So we have chefs, registered dietitians, health coaches, tobacco treatment specialists. Some of our coaches are certified in um, exercise as therapy as well. So many different programs and offerings that patients can engage in, depending on where they're starting from and what their health journey looks like and the goals that they're trying to achieve. This all sounds ideal for those looking to get healthy. And well, you mentioned chefs and dietitians, so let's, let's bring Chef Elizabeth in here because I'd love to know what delicious dish she has in store for us today. Chef Elizabeth, good morning to you. Hi, good morning. Yes, today we're here because um, we are launching our Plant Power Challenge, which kicks off in January. Um, on January 4th, and everybody can register. It's free. We have lots of great webinars. And so we want to show you one example today uh, of an appetizer we're going to make that's great for the holidays that really kind of showcases all the things we do in culinary medicine around making sure the dish tastes great, looks great, um, and is also great for you. So this is our sweet potato and avocado crostini that I'd love to show to all of you today. You ready? Go for it. I'm starving. Okay. Okay, good. People have no idea how to peel these things. I'm not sure what to do. So just a tip for everybody, what I love to do is I like to put it in a small bowl of water. I use a paring knife and then just right here at the top, I just insert the knife in the center and then just by putting it about halfway down and twisting it, that um, fruit will kind of just naturally pop open. And then once it pops open, of course it likes to give me a little trouble, um, once you kind of use your fingers to get in there and pop it open, you can then keep it in the bowl as you're peeling it and all of those little um, seeds kind of in the center will start to fall into the water so that way you don't end up with a bunch of uh, pomegranate juice all over your clothes. So that's a little tip for all of you to assemble this. Um, I've taken some sweet potatoes, I've roasted them in the oven, and then I've mashed up some avocado with a little bit of lime and a little bit of salt and pepper. And then I'm gonna place that on these little, what we call like sweet potato crostinis, um, and put them, uh, put that down like that. And this kind of gives you that like natural fat. Avocado is great for kind of that natural fat, coats your mouth, tastes great, it's also great for you. And then that pomegranate that I peel, I'm gonna put that on top. And when we eat, we eat with our eyes. So you really wanna think about, do you have some color? Is it gonna pop? Um, who doesn't love cilantro, right? So throw a little cilantro on. If you don't like cilantro, you could also use some parsley. And then finally, we'll sprinkle a little bit of black sesame seeds on top. 
So essentially, this is a really nice, super simple um, recipe that comes together very quickly. It doesn't cost very much to make. Um, and when you're done, you've got like a party on a plate. So um, <laughs> this is a great appetizer for everyone to try at the holiday times. Uh, looks delicious. And of course, we all know January 4th, you've got this 30-day plant-powered challenge where the food, the whole plant food is what you're challenging people to eat for 30 days. Can you quickly tell us what that's about? Yeah, so essentially people can sign up on our website, um, spectrumhealth.org uh, slash lifestyle medicine uh, program. So you can see the registration there. Anyone can register. We have all kinds of free webinars. Uh, we're recording them so people can't catch them at that time. They can watch them later. Uh, we've got chefs, physicians, dietitians, all talking about anything plant-based to help people on their journey. You don't have to exclusively jump into whole all plant-based eating. It's really the idea that around incorporating more fruits and vegetables and whole grains in your diet and how to do it in a way that like tastes great and is delicious. So we hope everybody joins us in that 30-day challenge. Uh, sounds like a good thing to do. Great way to start the new year. Thank you so much for the time, Chef Elizabeth and Christy from Spectrum Health. If you want to learn more, just head to spectrumhealth.org slash plantpower. We'll be right back.